Now move on to the next match, and here we have DeVito, runner of the YTWE, going against Whipping Boy, Fingle Bottom. Oh yeah, this should be a clear-cut match right here. I, I've been in the ring with both of these guys, and I think DeVito's definitely got the edge. Well, Fingle Bottom is mostly a marshmallow hack of Britt Wager's material, which was exposed by Maximania and Uncle I think he only... DeVito actually has some material. Yeah, I think uh, Fingle Bottom only won the King of the Ring because he took advantage of other people's hard work, much like he did on YouTube. Well, here we are. I think uh, might, al might almost be a tickle bottom trying to commentate. She is not authorized to commentate. Understood, CD. Yeah, nobody understands what the hell she's saying anyway. Well, if there's any cats nearby, they understand. I think she's saying, I'm on, I'm on. And here comes the hat. The Candyman cat. I like to call him the finger bottom. Well, he's the hack. Stole very bigger stuff. And the easy, the easy clues were the fact that before Fingal bottom, and he did have other stuff before on his account, his most name, was uh, Tickle bottom was on there first. Then later came Fingal bottom. Candy bar review by Britt Baker. Oh, he's reviewing candy. British accent, obviously. Well, if you want to call it a British accent, sometimes it goes with Mexican and Puerto Rican and mostly sounds like an old woman. Hmm. A large old woman. Uh -oh. Yeah, Fingle. it's going to be interesting to see DeVito and him fight. I mean, I know he's got the size and the power, but DeVito's got all the moves. Little bottom just moved the camera. Oh, she tends to do that sometimes. Does it look okay from your point of view there? Awesome. Okay, good. Little bottom, stop fooling around the commentary. There's Fingle Bottom looking at DeVito like he's a piece of chocolate. And the bell rings! I think DeVito. DeVito's gonna be more like a laxative and he's gonna run straight through his ass. <laughs> well, he's already got Fingle Bottom not against the ropes, but on the ropes. Oh! Uh-oh. Oh, and it crosses me. And you gotta, you gotta admit, he's, he's had, you know, a rough couple of months with his fed and then within this fed and I gotta say I've seen a little bit of a darker side come out at him a few more low blows a little bit more relentless fight and look at him wow bottom. good down oh he's coming back up oh and he goes down again are you giving the cameraman directions or are you like talking about the match. <laughs> a little bit of both. Do you have a good vantage point now? No. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh, look at him just chopping his ass away. See, that's what I said. He's more ruthless and relentless now than ever. Well, DeVito is probably holding the grudge about the Royal Rumble placing. And there's been a bit of a rivalry going on between the two feds. YTWE. Well, obviously, I always ble believed the deck was stacked against me because I was somebody who spoke his mind, his opinion, and, you know, maybe I get things in a way that they don't approve, but I got to get mine. And that's all I'm saying. Well, he's coming back as, as much as he can. I'm sure Britt Wigger will catch trouble when uh, those matches come around in the YTWE. Well, obviously. DeVito is currently on assignment at uh, British wrestling events. Oh, yeah, him and his oh, buddy no, Laser. Oh, my God. He just flew into the ring, and Harold goes under the ring, and oh, no, he's back in. Throw DeVito into the turnbuckle. Oh, my. Fingle Bottom seems to be ignoring oh. it, or he's dead. Don't he's look at us. Thing. Turn around. Turn around, Fingle Bottom. He's intentionally ignoring it so he doesn't lose face or something. Is he whistling? He looks like he's whistling. He oh, he's not whistling now. Wow. Harold hit him with a vicious shoulder block. Now, you, you got to admit, ever since the 6699 has won gold, these guys have been just vicious. Yes, he's a tag team champion, and he's I don't know why he's doing this. No, oh, Fingal Bottom splatted. Well, that, I, I've been hearing a little word in the locker room is they don't feel like they've gotten enough respect, that they're just as big dogs as everybody else, and they're out here to prove it. Well, Harold did one time comment about uh, 
questioning something about the championship. We weren't quite sure what he meant. It's very uh, cryptic. Looks like they're bloodthirsty for ex-champions. Well, oh. Vito is an ex-YTWE heavyweight champion. And Philip Fingerbomb, you just going to sit there? I think he is. I don't think he wants to get it there. No, he's just going to sit here and just stand and watch. See, he realizes this is uh, street fight rules. Yes. You know, oh my. It's much like a hardcore match in the YTWF, except you can only be pinned in the ring. And if there are submissions, you can use the ropes to break it, unless it's stipulated in the contract before the match. Well, DeVito does have his honor rules that he insists on. Uh oh Yeah, but Harold, these guys don't doing? play for honor. Oh, oh no. my. Tombstone! Oh, no. That is just going to tear him apart. Look, DeVito oh, kicked off, off of the ropes. And he reverses. He's got one last spot of NGN here. Oh. And oh, no. Hard into the turnbuckle. Oh, this is not good. Wow, that Harold took everything is out of the him. Area. The referee has shoot him away. Bingo Bottom slowly approaching. Yeah, you knew he was going to come in now and try to pick up the pieces. And Vito's like wondering what the hell's going on, why he didn't he help. He thought he had candy peanuts for brain. Vito asked him why he didn't help. That's why he didn't help, DeVito. He wants a victory. Probably if he wins this, it'll be his second victory ever. Candy stick kick. Oh, my. How sweet it is for him. Oh, this is not fair. DeVito had him in the bag. DeVito was just, oh, man, I lost money on this fight. One, two, Damn. three. Oh, no. I don't know if this is going to be the end. DeVito's got some pretty powerful friends in the YTWF. I guess, but they are uh, also friends of Great Wigger. Obviously, but that has nothing to do with what just happened to their boy. I mean... No, but he just can't have vigilantes running around. Harold would probably be better than that somehow. Possibly. Peter I don't know. The power of the this is a shame. Oh, well. I'm not. I'm not even a DeVito fan, but this.